Hello, everybody, and um, welcome to Lee Statham TV. Um, woke up this morning and saw the news, and um, big up to Jess, I put a video out there, and Connor speaking about it too. So, big up to him, and look, I want to share screen because I think this is important, and, and, and you know, we were really just today, we should be even more with it today, I'm afraid. Share screen, right. Um, Brighton activate um, release clause in Georgina Yerutas' contract. Brighton have activated a £40 million release clause in Leeds United forward Georgina Yerutas' contract. The Premier League club have report been reported to have bids of £29 million and £35 million um, for a Frenchman turned down by Leeds who do not want to lose their 22-year-old, um, the PNU um, under agency understands. No other club can activate a release clause after Brighton beat the midnight deadline on Wednesday. It is understood. Um, Leeds United signed Rutter in January last year on a five-year deal. Contracts from half a nine for a club record deal which could rise to £35 million. The Skybet Championship now, club now face an anxious wait for Rutter to decide whether he wants to stay with them or move to the top flight with Brighton. Now, look, guys, I'm going to be really honest with you. Right? Really, really honest with you. Playing in championship against teams like Derby, um, Preston, um, Portsmouth, or playing in playing against in, in a team like Brighton against players like uh, teams like Man United, Man City, Arsenal, Chelsea, Liverpool, Tottenham, West Ham. I know where I'd want to go. I really do. And this is a good. This is a good. Right. If you see the 49ers now, I've got they haven't got a say in it. Neither's neither Sarka, neither's Leeds United. No one's got a say in what apart from Rutter. If Rutter's agent gets on at him, Rutter will not be a Leeds United player. He will not be a Leeds United player. And if we lose um, Rutter, his goodbye to his um, pr um, um, pr promotion chances. I don't care who they bring in. Rutter, for in championship level, we are not going to get a replacement for Rutter. We're struggling to get a replacement for some of them, for God's sake. So we're not going to have to. We're not. We're going to end up getting a second string player, who, or we're going to try and make shift one of the, like someone playing that role. And 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 in that squad, and what like we saw yesterday, we've seen all the players now this season. We've seen us for starting eleven, and we've seen most of the players off at, on that bench, and not none of them are good enough to cover for Rutter. They, 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 you see, the problem is, right, they, they, this is that, um, unfortunately, that um, um, Victor Arter, he put this contract in, he put this release clause in, right? Now, when we bought him, I thought we paid too much money for him, right? I'll be the first one to say that. I'm not going to, I'm not going to sit here and say, oh, um, I always knew we were a good player. I, I had, I had doubts about him because I didn't see much of him when he were at Offenheim. But he's turned out to be one of the most important players Leeds United have got. And we can't afford to lose him as well. What, losing Grace, Somerville, and non, um, and Rutter all in one window? No, with no chance. If this happens, if this happens, the 49ers will not, will not, not know what to do. Because they did. They wouldn't have expected a club to um, to put in um, to activate a release clause by midnight. Um, like, just gone, you know. And and Brighton, let's be honest, when they when they see a player and when they see quality, they buy him. They 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 are the um, data driven club, and they are the best club at recruiting players. And but if they're willing to break their transfer record on Eugenio Rutter, that tells you just how good he is. That tells you just how good he is. And if we lose him, we're not replacing him. So he can kiss promotion goodbye this season and probably for the next two or three at the very least. And that's what I'm predicting. I predict that if we don't go up this year, we're going to be in this championship for a very, very, very long time. I know people will want to hear that, but you want me to be honest with you and I'm being honest with you. You know, it's, it, it, it's, then it goes on to say here as well, um, the Skybet Championship Club um, will now face an anxious wait for Rutter to decide whether he wants to stay or move to the top flight. 
with Brighton. He's an, he has established himself as a fan's favourite at Ellen Road, scoring eight goals and making 16 assists in a total of 60, 51 appearances last season, as Leeds missed out on an immediate Premier League return after relegation. Um, since losing 1-0 to Southampton in the playoff final at Wembley um, in May, um, they have sold two of their best players, Archie Gray and Chris Sensio Somerville, to Tottenham and West Ham, respectively. Um, Leeds fans have been expecting these departures. Gray for around £30 million, which could rise to £40 million, and Somerville is for reported £25 million plus add-ons. The loss of their talisman for Rutter following last um, Saturday's opening draw against Portsmouth would be a big blow. I'd say it would more than a big blow. It'll be it'll be TNT Dynamite explosion to to then Dan, manager Daniel Farkin's bid for automatic promotion this season. So that's the end of the article. So let's jump to the scheme. If I if I could sit down with Georginia Rutter, I would say to him, look, I'll be honest with him. And you might not like hearing this, so if you don't like hearing on this, you turn it off now. But I would say to him, Brighton is a really good club. It's well run. It's it's well, you know, it, it, it's well run. Um, they're an established Premier League side. Um, it would be a better move than staying at Leeds United. However, however, you stay at Leeds United, get Leeds United back into the Premier League, you could be that big hero. Um, like, like, dare I say it, as big as Hernandez. Honest to God, it could be, it could be a bigger hero than Pablo Hernandez if he stays. If he stays at Leeds United, the fans won't just love him; they will worship the ground he walks on. You know, and the reason why we don't discuss Rutter much in his, in his, um, in his, um, you know, his, his, his reactions and stuff, because we don't, because he, he everything he does. Is 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 fine. It's perfect. We can, we can't criticize a player. We don't talk about a player just to, to criticize them. We we criticize players who deserve to be criticized. And Rutter hardly ever gets mentioned because he's doing a really really good job. And you know it's it's um oh god it, it, it's not the news I wanted to hear this morning. I'll be honest with you guys. It's not the news I wanted to hear. Um. Yeah, so let us know what you think, guys. Loser attorneys at the end of his promotion. Can we kiss promotion goodbye this season? Because I think we can. Um, and also, you know, we, we, can we replace him? And the problem I've got is we're struggling to replace some of it. Never mind a sort of player like Rutter. It's going to be impossible. It's going to be, honestly, it's going to be impossible for the championship club to replace a player like Rutter. It's not happening, guys. It's really not happening. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you for watching this edition of Lee Statham TV. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video, or I hope, but while well, I hope you've enjoyed the content of the video, I, I hope that you're disappointed as, we, as much as me and Lee are about the news that Rutter's um, contract release clause has been activated. Anyway, thank you for watching this edition of Sable Team. So, sorry, start again. Thank you for watching this edition of Lee Statham TV. Um, until next time, guys, have a great day. Speak to you soon. Bye-bye.